gonna play Samus against Olimar? Oh, he's gonna play Charizard. Oh, he's gonna go Samus. Ah. Alrighty. So. Thanks, buddy. This is the best venue ever. I'm on the mic, and someone just delivered me chicken fingers. And I get to watch Dotcom's ass about to get beat. This is great. Three, so. Two, one, go. God damn. Kicks. Kicks. Oh, never mind. Type one in the chat if you think all Mars pivot grab is stupid. I want to see all those ones. If you think all Mars pivot grab is stupid, type one. Um, I actually have no clue how this matchup would go. I would assume it's in Samus' favor. But I don't know, Almar's kind of a hard character to hit. He's so tiny. And uh, he's pretty strong. He can, I, I wouldn't be surprised if he has some kill setups in Samus. Not be surprised at all, actually. Those Pikmin throws off the stage, though, with F Smash, they're really strategic, uh, strategically placed, and they're kind of hard to avoid. But it looks like uh, Dotcom's playing the matchup pretty smart so far. Oh, that pivot grab, raw. That's some raw stuff. Woo! The movement, he's flying. Okay. I have no idea what Samus really does about this character. Hmm. I don't know. It seems it's it's looking pretty difficult. He's so small, and Samus' moves only really hit like taller-ish characters, where people are short how bad her, but like, Armor plays pretty grounded, that will definitely kill, blasted in the face, at like 120 across the stage, oh, the read, fortunately doesn't get it, F smash, down smash, yeah, you gotta, you gotta just let Samus come up to the ledge, her ledge options are pretty poor, so you can just punch them from a distance. Oh, cool, that's death. Yeah, the purple Pikmin definitely is going to be the same as Killer. And he's got two of them. Especially with a fire and blue, those rack up a lot of damage if they cling on you. But he's not looking to throw his purple Pikmin just yet. Oh, racking up that damage with the fire, 5%. Definitely adds up. Nice up E by Dotcom. Using the Pikmin as uh, being a little elusive where he was exactly going to go. It's also really good too, the Pikmin, uh, eat the, eat the... Alright, that was Cheeks, I'm not gonna lie. That was pretty Cheeks. Usually don't see those kind of SDs from .com. Hopefully, uh, we don't, we don't see anymore. Oh, up tilt through the platform, kicks. Stiletto boots. That... That happened. I didn't know that could happen. That's, um, that's pretty unfortunate. So what happened there was that the Pikmin was actually attached to Chibo, and the charge shot hitbox was so big that it attacked the on-body uh, Pikmin that was on him. So effectively just eating his charge shot. Ooh, nice F smash to cover the landing. Hit him with the missile barrage. Down smash to cover the landing again. Nice jab. Reset the situation. Doesn't get a uh, suit of follow-up though behind it. Trade? That's gonna go in both of their favors, I would say. Because uh, he's definitely close to killing uh, Chibo, and uh, is definitely gonna die at some point from some uh, tilt or smash attack. Oh, this is the up air, but that will kill. Reverse hit forward air, going across the stage. His purple Pikmin's are pretty powerful. 
Dotcom's gonna... He just wanted to play a little bit of the percent game there. He recalled all of his Pikmin and just kept throwing them until he eventually died. Wow, great jungle game going on by Dotcom right now. Oh, the mix-ups! He thought he was... Ooh! That was dirty. I like the decision making on those last few um, interactions between Dotcom and Chibo. Chibo was trying so hard to land and Dotcom was just not allowing it. Too many mix-ups. Can I help you? I don't get that. No. Dotcom actually doesn't know. That's the tater top that will make him lose the set. Three, two, one, go! Okay, so it looks like that uh, Olimar has some throw follow-ups at 0%. And earlier, even later too. Armand pretty much has combos up throws versus like any character. It's actually really impressive how the character can be so undervalued, but like he has like a lot of great tools against some characters. It's just recovery is just so poor. And a lot of characters have good tools to uh, remove Pikmin off of themselves. I like the choice to S-Smash the Pikmin to uh, put in its stun so Dotcom uh, doesn't have the choice of recalling it and adding it back into the order. Very smart decision by Chibo. And it gets himself in early stock in this game, too. Uh, DI down, and put in a move and uh, cancel his momentum going towards the last one, so he ends up using his stock at about 100%. Up throw. Oh, wow. That was actually super smart. What Dotcom actually waited for there was um, the stun from the fire or yellow Pikmin to actually put him in hit stun so he could get a better follow up. But I think Chibo just nared out narrowly in time to uh, cancel out the fire before putting him in hit stun. But I like the idea from Dotcom. He's definitely um, paying close attention to the Pikmin he has attached to Chibo. Oh, the F smash to cover the ledge option. That won't kill. If that was a purple, that definitely would have been a stock. He's throwing out a yellow? I thought that was a purple one. Oh. He may have uh, uh, grappled there. He could just roll here. Does he get the edge guard? Well, I wanted to see a grab by Chibo or something. He hasn't really grabbed much. Sammy says grab isn't that bad in this game, especially if she has some solid follow ups. Nice F tilt. Zone out with Dotcom's uh, aerial approach. Bounce up the same high, he's gonna charge. Smart decision. He doesn't really have strong juggling options, so he's just going to uh, opt for charging one of his best kill moves. Uh, deep. So Dotcom racing to the finish. Down into the blast zone. Missing Chibo completely. He saw opportunity, but he just kind of next executed and ended up SDing. Not a big deal, especially since he still has a lead. He's had Chibo on the ropes in the corner, especially in the corner. He's had Chibo like in the corner like the entire game, it's making it very difficult for Chibo to set up his zone. At a 159%, there's not much you can do with Samus. Especially against someone with such strong kill power as the pur purple Pikmin Olimar. Got him off stage. This is his chance. I don't think he actually would have made it over the stage, and even if he did, I kind of wanted to see a ledge hop down here instead of narrowing him across the stage. Kind of get a pop up into like a, a strong move or something. Even up till that recovery, easy with, uh, with Samus. Olimar can't really sweet spot that well. Nice missile. Alright, let's see if Chibo can make a comeback here. He needs to uh, be mindful of uh, what Pikmin.com has out, and he just needs to get him off stage. That's where all of my really struggles against most characters. Gets the grapple, but he's in a really dire position. He just took about 20% off of that mistake. And it's definitely going to rack up. Eventually he's going to get a purple and he's going to kill. 
Nice snare to beat out the Pikmin. He's got a purple. Fourth throw? Wow! The winner is... Alright, so 2-0.